What's up, guys? Welcome to the second episode of the Dabcast. It's been a little bit over a week since the first episode due to some complications involving uh, myself and the other dickhead here, Victor. Um, hey, I went on vacation. Coronavirus as well. Vacation. Sh- you better have been wearing a fucking mask, you piece of shit. I did wear a mask. <laughs> did you wear a mask? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, but speaking of viruses, uh, speaking of viruses, you guys want to talk about uh, Tier 3 subs on Twitch? <laughs> that was very smooth. <laughs> listen, <laughs> listen, shut the fuck up. <laughs> shut the fuck up. Alright, so as I'm sure anybody watching this is aware, the three people from our friend group that have watched it, maybe, maybe one day when we get that Raid Shadow Legend sponsorship and people come back to watch the old stuff. Yeah, people will watch us because we get sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends. Yeah, yeah. What do you mean? <laughs> yeah. Well, we listen, have that. Raid Shadow Legends is such sponsored. a good brand, okay? It is a fucking yeah. amazing mm-hmm. brand. Don't you talk shit yeah. on them. I agree. Raid, please sponsor us and give us so I'll, much Yeah, money. I agree to further notice. But again, yeah. back to that yeah. smooth thing. As I'm sure everyone's aware, whether you're big into like drama on social media or not, um, currently going on, there is Twitch versus YouTube, the streamers versus the YouTubers. All because Leafy wanted to call Pokimane ugly and say she wasn't funny. Um, I don't think she's that ugly. You know, I, I myself have wanked at least once to her. I, I, from my memory, only po- once. Uh, you know, it was whatever. <laughs> it was whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Pokimane's, uh, I, I can see the appeal what, of what her. Image she's really choose? slender what? and uh, oh, I think very it was proportional. A, I think it was a video. It was like, I, I don't, you know, from the stream, of course. She had, like, some shit on, and it was see-through, and I guess she didn't have any underwear on, mm-hmm. so you could just see her bare ass. Really? So, I was like, okay. I was like, I... Could you just <laughs> tell me the name of that so I can do it for, like, research purposes? She can find it. I can play on, like, the r slash pokey thick or pokey main hot or whatever <laughs> thing. r slash pokey NSFW. Yeah, it's probably on one of those. Um, you know, one time, I know there's, like, the tier threes that probably have a shrine to her and they offer her their male energy every day um mm-hmm. i definitely don't do that jar. With a certain why would female. you want that though you know males are trash yeah, dude. males are such pieces of shit i hate men men <laughs> the pokey jar men are disgusting <laughs> but yeah. Is a jar. yeah does pokemon have a u2s or whatever does she have one of those uh, i think she does <laughs> you know they've made a cock jar of it you know they have yeah i, I bet there is but yeah you know, she's she's attractive. I don't think she's ugly by any means. Yeah. Um, if we're do, if we're doing do the out of ten, I'd say about like a seven. I'd say like a two. <laughs> I'm gonna pull a Keemstar. <laughs> yeah, you know, two, two out, out of ten. ten. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, I think a seven's pregnant. good. She's not like, you know, she's not she's not hideous by any means. Yeah. Um, she's pretty average looking, but she's. You know, she, her she's got a bit of an ass on her. It's not like baby got it's back. It's not humongous, yeah, but I you agree. know, like it's you know, the cheeks would be clapping. <laughs> they would be moving. <laughs> we rate women cheeks. on this podcast. Yeah, God, yeah. What? But you, you can't Listen, say that. We Susan's support cut women, our budget. and I think it's very impressive the streaming empire Pokemon's made over the years. What's she like number six yeah. on Twitch? I think that's very impressive. We're not saying women are objects at all. Like this is actually serious. This isn't even a thing to cover our own asses. Mm. But we're just talking about whether we find women hot or not, which I think is important to this argument since part of it is Leafy saying she's ugly. Uh or not mm. hot. I don't think he ever said she was ugly, but you know implied two out of ten um, can be funny and and, and, <laughs> and women can a- absolutely rate men all they want you can rate me i mean I, of course i'm a six foot tall football player so or sorry not just oh, six yes. foot, i'm six five football player i'm fucking i choose jacked. to work out the library yeah it, like if, <laughs> if if you women saw me let's just say <laughs> let's just say you might get pregnant just from the sight of me like wow. I don't want to intimidate so you. Just you come t- on them. No, 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 no. <laughs> I'm just saying, I have so much testosterone that even uh, though sperm is what gets women pregnant, my uh, overflowing testosterone is what's going to get them pregnant. Ew! You come, bro. Uh, you come. What's come? What's come? <laughs> oh, okay, good. I've never jerked you... off in my life. What okay, even is good. masturbation? Good. I'm, I'm too pure. What are these? What are I'm a, a wizard. Sin, you know. <laughs> I'm a wizard. 
<laughs> I'm an ancient dragon. <laughs> We're not talking about the KKK, Victor. <laughs> Who said I was? No, that's the the grand grand uh, wizard, grand, grand wizard, wizard and yeah. grand dragon. Um, back to the initial topic again. Women, you can rate us men all you want, and we'll continue to rate you. Um, however, if you say yeah. I'm not going to date a six foot tall man, and then get mad if someone <laughs> says they're not going to date a three hundred pound woman, then you're a shallow piece of garbage. Fuck you. Um, yeah, mm. but you know, short kings unite. I'm not short, of course. I'm six five. Yeah, I thought you were six foot, dude. I'm no. Yeah, I just well, why, I, why would you? Why would you agree with the short kings then? No, it's just that, I, that I, I, you know, because I have some short friends and they're really funny. You uh-huh. know, they're really oh, okay. funny. They're like the funny. They're the funny ones. Right now. Yeah. They're really funny. They're super funny. You're just uh, you're just you're sticking with the bro code, right? Just helping a bro, yeah, out, right? Yeah, because I think it's That's fucked up. All right, yeah. Um, but yeah, again, back to Pokemon's decently hot. You know, she's not like, you know, she's not like a certain woman that I have an you know affiliation with. Um, oh yeah, an affair? No, no, I'm not. You gonna shout out? No, I'm not going to shout out because okay. it'll be very, very easy to, you know. Okay. Okay. Yeah. That's unimportant, even though I'm sure eventually, you know, we're going to talk right. about that here. But we're not going to worry about it for now. Uh, okay. But, you know, she's not ugly. I, I, Leafy probably I, – I think Leafy would fuck. I, I think he's kind of yeah, on he's some just bullshit. Trolling. He's just yeah, he's just – he's baiting, just like Keemstar with 2 out of 10, even though <laughs> – I, I don't know. There are virgins attacking uh, isn't me. Isn't Keemstar married though? <laughs> I think he has a girlfriend. I don't think he's married anymore. I thought he had a kid. He does have a kid, but I don't think he's with the mother of the kid anymore. I don't, I don't know, though. Oh. I, I know he has a girlfriend currently, but I don't know if – I don't think it's the mother of his daughter. Oh. But as we also know, you know, <laughs> he starts setting such a bad yes. fucking example for his daughter by saying Pokemon 2 out of 10. I think it is funny, even <laughs> though in general that tweet was obviously bait to get a bunch of people angry. You know, Which it's very – <laughs> oh, yeah, he did. I think it's very interesting <laughs> that they immediately assumed he was talking about her looks when, you know, he probably was in that bait tweet, but he could, yeah. as he's saying now, just be talking about her as a content creator. I don't think that's what he was talking about. Oh, no, yeah. But. Oh, of course. But, you it, know. It's, it's still funny because, you yeah. know, he can say that yeah. now and be like, oh, well, I wasn't. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, no. Also, yeah. I would like to apologize to viewers of the last podcast for uh, my mic sounding like it was in a microwave. Um, you're probably hearing a bit of that right now, looking at my audio. Uh, I'll try to get that fixed eventually. Just bear with us. Those it's not these two noises, faults. Victor. Um, Thank you. Again, though, you don't even ha- – you can't really get mad at me because I'm 6'5 and fucking gorgeous. <laughs> so, you know, it's it's not I, big. I'd go gay for chance, but exactly. I'm not gay myself. You know, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say something we can't say. It's about to make No, what? <laughs> no, ahead. I'll make it. It's not even that big of a deal. It's not yeah, June no anymore, so Victor can't be gay. You know? <laughs> and that is a I'm joke. That is a no. I think you, you actually check my think gallery. That. I think those. <laughs> you think I'm homophobic? Yeah, I think those words <laughs> you just uttered. Yeah, uh, they lie be. very closely to your core beliefs. You're probably right. You're probably <laughs> right. I'm pretty homophobic, but again, it's just a joke. We have an edgier sense of humor, as you know. I mean, again, we're talking to people that are literally within our friend group. We're but, not like the other kids. Yeah, we're not like the other <laughs> girls. Ramona Flowers out here, bro. Colin is actually Colin's actually he's actually emo. Yeah. Colin really, I, uh, really loves Panic at the Disco and My Chemical Romance. Those I are like, like his eyeliner. favorite bands. Yeah, yeah I, I Colin has a spiked choker on all the time. He yeah. kinda looks like he has a combination really thick eyebrows. He kinda looks like a combination of Gwen and Duncan from Total Drama Island. <laughs> um <laughs> Except he's also Indian. That's the weirdest part. Because <laughs> he's got a dot on his forehead, right? Oh, my God. <laughs> These are also jokes. These are also jokes. <laughs> what do you oh mean? Boy. You haven't seen the dot on his forehead? Oh, my God. <laughs> I, I do not Very condone spicy. what Victor is saying. I do not condone. Colin is my good emo Indian friend. Yeah. Oh. Uh. 
He's also, like, really bad at school. <laughs> he gets horrible grades. Like, oh my God, I remember back in the day, because we're, like, 40 years old now, as I'm sure you're all aware. <laughs> is, Colin, is this the lore Colin of the podcast? Like, Colin was like, you know what, yeah, sh- I'm going to shut the fuck up. This was, this was funny, but now I'm making it stupid. <laughs> back to Pokemane. So, yeah, she's pretty hot. Yeah. Leafy would probably fuck. He's just baiting. Same with Keemstar. I think Keemstar would fuck <laughs> many, many things. I think he'd fuck a dude, even. Keemstar looks like he would fuck a dude just to, like, prove a point. Like, he seems like the type of guy that would be, that, like, some guy would be like, you're gay, dude, like, as an insult. And he'd be like, oh, yeah? And he'd pull his dick out. He's like, then let me fuck you in the ass if I'm so gay, dude. Yeah. He seems like he'd do it just to prove a point. Oh, I, 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 I wouldn't think he'd be dumb and I, I think he'd be submissive. I think he'd go over and, like, pull their pants down and just start sucking the dick off. Oh, because know? he's so dumb. would be dominant. But what if it's like the the switch thing? Like he's so dominant in real life, but he's a sub. Like he's oh. dominant in the streets, submissive oh. in the sheets. Oh, he's a bottom. Oh, I see. Yeah. So he's he's, he's a, a power, power bottom. bottom. He's a power Ooh, bottom. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um. Yeah, <laughs> I, I think that's how Keemstar would work. <laughs> um. But yeah, now that we've rambled for like twelve fucking minutes about Pokemane's ass. <laughs> they call him being Indian. <laughs> are being gay. <laughs> Power <laughs> bottom. Oh, yeah. Wait, we can do the destiny thing about how he said. I, I, I unironically think Leafy's gay. We can I'm going to psychoanalyze this person I know nothing yeah. about. <laughs> <laughs> like, listen, pretend I'm very smart. I would like to say I actually don't hate destiny. Mm-hmm. I did hate him when I first saw him. Like, I really, like, I first saw him on destiny the, I believe it was the, the Austin word. show. Um, mm-hmm. But, dude, I like, I don't know. I think watching his stuff is interesting because, like, I, I tend to disagree with a lot of the things he says. But I, I do think, as lame as it sounds, it is like a – it's almost a, like a good, like, thinking exercise sometimes. But then on the yeah. other hand, like, you'll listen to him talking and you're like, oh, my God, you're being such a smug little bitch right now. Yeah, right now he's on my <laughs> shit list. Yeah, I, I could understand that because I, 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 I'm sub to his YouTube, like, <laughs> clips channel. And I remember I saw the mm-hmm. notification and I watched his reaction to the Leafy video and just remember thinking, you're getting, like, was Leafy bullied by iDubs? Yeah. And was the content comp mm-hmm. a big factor in Leafy leaving? Yes. But I wouldn't exactly say uh, he was bullied off the internet. I think that's a bit of a... Oh, yeah. I wouldn't say that. I think Because I think he just left because he wasn't really getting money. I think that's moreover <laughs> what it was. Apparently he's making bank, money. too. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. I bet he would. Well, yeah, especially with, like, the the Lucky merch or whatever. I don't remember what it's called. Yeah. Something Lucky. Because he came over luck, like, five minutes again. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I've never come in my life. My balls are so huge. But, you know, I'm just saying, like, Colin recently educated me on how it happens. Uh, I never heard of it before. I didn't even yeah. I didn't even know people had sex. I, it's, it's pretty so, gross. It's so weird. Yeah. Fucking. It's like peeing yeah. white. Gross. Yeah. <laughs> That's a fucking stupid bit. <laughs> um, yeah, but I, I think Keemstar is unironically gay, though. Like, he, he's making... He, he's saying Pokemane's 2 out of 10. He must be gay. <laughs> right, uh-huh. because if you were straight, you would find women attractive, right? Yeah, if you were straight, you'd want to fucking slam dunk Pokemane's fucking doo-doo hole, dude. I think you hit Why the nail on the head hole? there. Yeah, you think I did? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I don't I know. didn't answer my question. Why the doo-doo hole? Oh, because, dude, you just gotta go. <laughs> gotta, get, gotta get the doo-doo hole juice, bro. <laughs> <laughs> trying, to the brown make, trying to make that shit look like the <laughs> Star Wars trash compactor, you feel me? You know? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> the Moroccan cheeks. <laughs> Are you sure you don't want to go to the Starlight Pit? <laughs> no, that's um, that's Jenna, and we're not talking about oh. the Twitch streamer. We're talking about somebody else. Who's Jenna, we're not getting Colin. We're we not did. getting. We're, we're not, not getting, getting false that? DMCA. We'll get into okay. that another oh, day. Yeah. Okay. I want to make a whole. That, that's for another I podcast. Make a whole video essay about it. Remember. <laughs> yeah. Even though. Well, do you want to do the video essay first or the? Yeah, podcast I think that'd episode? be better, and then talk about it on here. I think okay. That'd be interesting. Yeah. Same with my SAO once. I want to make but fun no, of Jenna. 
Yeah, no, no, we totally will. We totally will. You yeah. guys, you know, you guys can be in the video. You're my friends, you know. I, I guess we're my friends. <laughs> oh, are we? Like I, 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 I didn't know consider that. you a friend, I guess. So, um, <laughs> yeah, okay. We keep getting sidetracked talking about dumb shit. <laughs> yeah, Twitch versus YouTube. So, uh, who, who, do, who do you think? Whose side are you on? Even though I think, I think I know whose side we're you, on. Well, I've seen. I've only seen Leafy. And Keemstar attack Pokimane, and then uh, people um, defend Pokimane. Well, whole, That's all I've seen. The, so, I've where seen are the that, sides here? I, no, uh, there was a video I sent to Dab Chat last night that was made by the commentary channel Optimus. That was like, uh -huh. I, I wouldn't say it was a fantastic video. It was kind of a mess because it had so many different sections. It was kind of, but it was kind of like the uh, most of the commentary community uniting and they were like all in that video talking about Pokimane mm -hmm. oh, aside okay. from some people that don't deserve to be there like a certain long-tongued individual <laughs> I'm Alex Mr. False Rape <laughs> a a Accuser I'm Alex as well as his other <laughs> compadres that also sent out false rape accusation against against Slazo uh, but that's a your old story. You're Let's gonna just... be crying in your room. Your Let's tiny little watch room. YouTube. No, you're watching YouTube. <laughs> on the YouTube. <laughs> yeah, but let's just say fuck those people that did that. But it was like there's Optimus there, Turkey Tom, and a bunch of other people that are like part of the current day commentary community. You probably don't know many of them. I myself didn't know many of them either. But it was like an hour long <laughs> video of them all like being like, yeah, Pokemon's False copy strikes people like Bo uh, Bull Blacks mm -hmm. um, in general isn't funny, isn't transformative and reacting to videos and all that shit. And just overall seems yeah. like a pretty scummy person. Um, <laughs> as well as, of course, people being like, bro, this shit, like Twitchers, YouTube, this is so stupid. Which it is because it's just fucking online yeah. drama. But, like, you know, you don't have to fucking be that guy like, oh, man, this is stupid. Like, bro, come on. I'm above this. I'm above this, yeah, but I'm in this hour-long video talking about it. <laughs> <laughs> so dumb. But yeah, I, I'm on Team YouTube personally, and not because I'm like, yeah, dude, Pokemon is ugly, bro. Just because it's like, it's more over on like the reacting to videos point. Because it's like, I, mm -hmm. I've thought, because you know, I, I watch X, I've been watching XQC for a little while. Yeah. Like a year uh -huh. or two, maybe. Maybe <clears throat> more. Um, and it's, I, I have, of course, seen reactive videos and be like, this is not. He's not saying anything, you know, but yeah. I just didn't yeah. care because it's like, whatever, dude. And that's what they're going to do. Why Why do I give a fuck? I'm not going to, like, get up and chat and be like, bro, you're just like Jinx. What the <laughs> fuck, dude? Which they are being just like Jinx Reload. Um, and, you know, it's not right and it's <laughs> illegal, but... Mm -hmm. it's eh, whatever. Like, I I'm not going to, like, get up in arms about it because it's not like I, I don't. I don't have like, I don't a care platform that much. to like shut somebody down. I don't like mm -hmm. care care, but I think it is sad that they want to argue that it's actual entertainment or like again as the yeah. one guy well, who I think like like don't get me wrong like Destiny's whole take about I think Leafy's unironically gay is really stupid, but I yeah. I think the worst take by far is the guy Hassan Hasanabi. Holy shit, dude! The whole fucking mm -hmm. YouTubers have a Patreon and release one to two videos a month and come out with mm -hmm. a six-figure paycheck. So at least 100000 ju yeah. just off of Patreon and one or two videos. Yeah. That Bro, I said it in our and I said it in our group chat and I'll say it again. Colossal must make like $4 million then, <laughs> <laughs> every time he uploads every other year. <laughs> Like, it's so um, ridiculous, yeah. and then it's, like, even to just, mm -hmm. e even if you're just gonna, like, humor that idea, because it's completely false, even yeah. even the people that do, like, make little content and just make, like, one or two mm -hmm. videos a month, or even less, they are not coming yeah. out with a six-figure paycheck, because AdSense is at its all-time low mm -hmm. on YouTube, in general. As you can tell, w we have the actually a nine-figure paycheck from, from what YouTube. from what I've seen on, like, YouTubers' Patreons... They'll have like one or two tiers. They're not getting a lot of money yeah. from that. It's not like cosplayers, Patreons, where they have like 
like five to eight tiers, like one hundred fifty dollars, one hundred fifty dollars, and, and then there's like a top tier that's like three hundred, and they don't even get any new benefits. It's just like I, I've seen this one girl. I think it, I, I might be mispronouncing it, but what I understand her name to be is Katiuska Moonfox. And she actually offers yeah. nudes, which is uncommon among a lot of cosplayers from what I've seen. She had, like, I it think is. originally I saw one tier, but I think there's two of them now. Like, one was, like, 300 and I think I saw one that was even more expensive. But I don't remember, so I'm not going to say anything. That was just people mm-hmm. – and I, I truly believe she's not even lying here. People requested for her to have a higher tier so they could just give her Holy more shit. money. Holy shit. They which have, like, I, a fetish, dude. I fully believe that that's the truth. I don't think she's lying about that, honestly, because I would not put that past people. Well, well, if they're do- like, she wouldn't do it otherwise if people were asking for that. Like, yeah, because she just looked greedy. Yeah, it wouldn't. Yeah, but I, I absolutely believe that people requested that. I do not think she's lying in that. Um, I guess that's a fetish. Mm-hmm. Like that has to be a I, fetish. I, I, I don't know. What like. What do you mean by that? Like for her specifically, like, or just wanting to? No, no, no. For for the for the guys doing it to to give. No, no, her no. Money. I mean like, no. What I mean by that is, I'm not saying it's her fetish. I'm saying she like her as a person has like they're giving that her so much money that she herself has become a fetish to them, even though she's just an individual mm-hmm. person. Oh no, that's not what I meant. Okay, so uh, I've just hopped onto her Patreon, and there are four tiers. Uh, three. Four. You yeah. Sure so more? the first one is a uh, a thank you, which is like you get like some di- nice Discord thing. How much? It's like one dollar oh. a month, and then there's Moogle, Ifrit, and I'm guessing this is Yojimbo or Yojibo. I don't know how you say that, but I'm <laughs> guessing guy, probably these three tiers are are basically uh you know you get you get the you get the stuff, but uh the prices go pretty steep. You go from forty dollars to seventy five dollars, and then uh. Three hundred and fifty dollars. That's the one that, unless something has changed, yeah. is the one that nothing new gets. No, offered. this, this the all it says curve. is uh, gambling with a sundry. I see, and this is just an extra support to you. That's yeah. all it is. That's exactly what, what I was talking fuck, about, dude. You get everything in the what is this? The Ifrit bundle. $75 yeah, this, this a get, month? yeah, get this everything. has definitely changed. I want to say she had more tears before, but yeah, uh, where's they even going? This yeah, like they're making pretty good money and a lot of them like a lot of the cosplayers it's that and like only fans they're, they're just making money off of that mm-hmm. like that's their source of income and it's like whether you you know of course you're gonna have people oh, simp simp <laughs> simp funny simp, simp, simp word um whether you think that's mm-hmm. simping or not i don't give a fuck myself you can go on twitter and call somebody a simp because th- they want to jerk off to pictures of specific women Dude, why do you even care is the better question. Like, why why, why do you care that they want pic- – because that's, to me, what I look at it as. Mm-hmm. They want pic- They want to jerk off to this specific one because I always, as I've talked about before, I think the argument that you know Pornhub's a thing, right, is so stupid. Because it's like not that there aren't attractive porn stars, but it's like it's not the person they want to jerk off to. That's the point. Yeah. So it's so stupid to be like, oh, go to porn. But whatever. That's besides the point in general. I don't know why you give a fuck what they're spending their money on. Um, and I used to think the same way. But, of course, things have changed. Yeah. Um, Back when I yeah. got that Dragon it Quest sure Builders. Mm. <laughs> well, no, that, that. Wow. Yeah, that's I mean, a waste of money, Colin. It, listen, man. It, it looked like a pretty shitty game. But that's besides the point. No, bro. It's fire. Fire. Um... But yeah, I, I th- getting back to the original topic, they're making a, and I, I I'm not going to put a price because there's no way to check like, in like how much people are in each tier, like to an oh, outsider. Yeah. You can see how many Patreons they have total, so you can lowball and see like the bare minimum they'd be making per month. But they're making a decent amount of money because to, for most of them that mm-hmm. I know, of, like the bigger ones, of course, <laughs> that that is their source of income. That and now more recently, OnlyFans as well. That is that. That's it. Like that's their income. So like that makes sense. I could be wrong, but the YouTubers' Patreons that I know of, they are not making uh, off of that and one or two YouTube videos. They are not making not a six-figure income. Yeah. 
at all. Uh, I have a particular YouTube that I enjoy watching who puts out a video whenever he wants and he does his Patreon like per video. So I think that's genius because you can go like two months without a video and you won't get charged on Patreon until that video is made. Yeah, I just, I, I don't know. It's like, oh, so I, it's a flat price for video? Yeah. Hmm. Um, I just think. And I, I guess there's also Discord benefits, but I have to look at his Patreon, to be honest. Even though I do like, like this content a lot. I don't know. Like, they're all. It's like, I don't think I've ever seen many go like above like $20 or anything. Like yeah. on YouTube oh, or I... Patreons, when it's like, like stuff. Yeah. Like, I, I'm checking right now, like the exact ones, but like, <laughs> like cold ones or like super mega or anything. I don't think I've mm-hmm. seen shit like, yeah, literally super mega. Super mega is just five dollars. That's it. That's that's their c- wow. Cap or... Yeah, they. Th- that's it. They just have five dollars. That's oh, the just only $5. tier. Uh, here, let me do the math real quick because I see. It. They're actually probably making a decent amount of money for this. Wait, doesn't doesn't Patreon show you how much money they're making? Uh not to my knowledge. Mm. I swear it did for me. Like I I'm pretty sure they show the um they show their <laughs> how many patrons they have, but not how much money they're making. I've never seen that on Patreon. Oh. Yeah. And if they have multiple, I've seen that before. And if they have multiple tiers. Colin's got a master account. If they have multiple <laughs> tiers. Okay, so actually Super Mega. They're not making a six-figure a month salary, but they are making decent money off of Patreon because you can actually calculate how much they're making since they just have one tier. They are making at the current moment twenty-seven thousand and thirty-five dollars a month. Twenty-seven thousand thirty-five dollars a month. Oh, damn. But there is something to consider there. Again, YouTube AdSense is at an all-time low. Their videos are rather shorter, and what, to the algorithm, it's all about watch time right now. It's not like yeah. before. Yeah. It was like 10-minute videos, pump them out, get a fuckload of money because it, AdSense was at a better time, like the leafy days, like in 2016. Yeah. yeah. Now, in general, Super Mega doesn't upload that much either recently. like They do like mainly their podcast. So they mm-hmm. could even be used mm-hmm. for this example. They're not making six figures. They're not. Oh, definitely. They're not. not. Maybe a year they're making six figures. Well, definitely off of this Patreon patrons, but not a not a month. It's so stupid. Yeah. But honestly, I don't even know why this is an argument because it doesn't even matter if they are or not. Even though anybody uploading one or two videos a month is not making this much money. But besides the point, of course, you're gonna sit there and criticize them for making money. And getting mad when ones will call you out for um, for saying you're not being transformative. And even though whether you want to consider yourself transformative or not, they aren't transformative, most of them at least. People like Pokimane, XQC, Hassan, they're not being transformative. But, mm, of course, whatever, they are watching these said videos that these one or two videos that the YouTubers upload in a month. Not mm-hmm. saying anything, eating their fucking food, and making bank off of people <laughs> subbing and donating, benefiting. Don't forget the Twitch Prime. Yeah, bene- exactly. Twitch Prime benefiting from these people that they're like, oh, YouTubers are always on this shit. Blah, 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 blah. It's so dumb. You're going to get mad at them saying, again, six-figure salary, not happening for most of them. Of course, Mm -hmm. of course, really big ones. Like, I'm sure somebody like – no, I'm not even going to say that. I was about to say I'm sure somebody like Keemstar is making bank. But there's a lot of avenues of income with Keemstar. He's got like the Spotify, Mom's Basement podcast. He's on YouTube, Snapchat, TikTok, now Storyfire. Mm -hmm. So he probably is making – What's Storyfire? Oh, it's a new thing. It's pretty much like a competitor to YouTube. Uh, Quite frankly, I endorse it. It was made by the YouTuber McJuggernuggets, the guy who did like the Psycho Dad. Oh series. shit, that dude. Yeah, yeah. Oh, he, I remember he, him. Yeah, he made Story Fire to be a competitor to YouTube because pretty much it was like, I I I actually just watched. He was on last week's Mom Basement podcast, the one with Colossal uh-huh. and Keemstar and Face Banks. Um, and I, I was listening to it today. Um, and it was something like. Um, how, like, if, if your shit got, like, demonetized and all that, 
YouTube had been saying all this time, oh, it doesn't affect like people being able to find your stuff and they're recommended or on trending, even though pretty obvious to anybody, of course it's going to affect that. But YouTube had been saying, yeah. oh, no, it's not. It's not. Um, and then he kept like pestering them about him, like his partner agent or whatever about it. Um, and eventually he did find out and he like recorded it like about f figuring this out and posted it on Twitter and they were like, y you're never going to be eligible for partnership again now because you did this because he, he, uh, exposed them pretty much. So he got pissed oh, off true. over that and made a uh, story fire, which works differently. Yeah. But from what I get, I still need to download it honestly, cause I do want to start using that because I think in general, YouTube needs more competitors rather than something like Vimeo, you know, that will never be. <laughs> um, Brazil. But even besides that, something not only does YouTube need competitors, they just need to be outright beaten. Um, yeah. But so I think something like this is really good, and especially since it's created by a YouTube creator, and it's not mm -hmm. something being backed by fucking Google, and all they care about is getting money, which of course all they care about is getting money, yeah. but you know what I mean. Um, yeah. I, I think it's a really good thing. I actually care about the creators. Yeah, but I remember getting really invested in, in the Psycho like, series. Nuggets. Yeah, I, I remember I watched it <laughs> once it was over. Like I heard on like oh, Drama oh. Alert or Scarce or something that oh it had ended, um, mm. and I was like oh okay, and I went and watched it all in like two days. It was good, man. All right, not <laughs> all of it because I did. There was like one playlist that's like everything that was even somewhat related, and then there was another one that was like fifty videos that was like the core ones that were like like one was with filler one was without filler you know what i mean <laughs> yeah yeah uh -huh. um and i watched the one without filler even though i would have watched the other one if i knew about it but once i had finished the other one i'm i don't really care to go back and watch the other fucking 550 episodes um you're not a true Yeah, fan. but in general, my take really with the YouTube versus Twitch thing, I think Twitch streamers are being very entitled. Whether whether YouTubers are making a fucking six-figure salary or not doesn't really matter because you're benefiting through their uh -huh. content. You're not being transformative, and transformative is not subjective. I love you, XQC, but that is fucking brain dead. Absolutely stupid. Yeah. Again, that that is like the, the jinx thing. I think he said something like this as well. The jinx thing with a... I I thought it was free advertising, bro. I was endorsing <laughs> them, <laughs> you know. Yeah. Uh huh. And it's like you know, I I think that it was from like a daily dose of internet. Like the guy who makes those videos was like, oh no, I actually enjoy streamers um, reacting to my stuff because it makes me it lets me know if it was good or not, and that's fine. I'm not saying YouTubers should have a problem with them reacting to it. I just think they need to be upfront that what they're doing isn't transformative. Yeah. I, I yeah. actually enjoy um, watching XQC watch because you know sometimes he'll interject with like reactions and shit. Yeah, well, uh, I, 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 I do I'll still wish watch it as would, well. I don't you know, mind the idea of people reacting to it. It doesn't even I have wish to be like up to it. It doesn't even like, have hey. to be like some big like H three H three like commentary reaction sort of thing. You just yeah. actually have to give feedback, and you shouldn't. Another thing, and I, Bo Blacks, uh, he's, I don't, you guys have probably seen his shit and you're recommended at least once or twice. He just, he reads the tweet, like Twitter arguments out. Mm -hmm. uh, he, I don't know, actually pretty helpful, to be honest. Because, except for the ones that he's involved in, he's not really biased because he's just reading the tweets, you know? Yeah. And fucking, if, I'm just saying, if AdSense was bigger now, he would be making so much money. I have no doubt in my mind. He'd be making a fucking, you know, like 80-figure salary, you know. <laughs> the number just keeps going yeah, up. Yeah, just, just keep increasing it every time we talk Those about Bezos it. Those Bezos numbers. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. He'd be richer than Jeff Bezos. Um, he had an argument with XQC on Twitter about it. And uh, I'm trying to remember the exact point. But it was pretty much like roughly around. He's like it was actually a pretty tame argument. Like at first, it started with like XQC, XQC saying stick to drama and not like legal stuff. And it's like, dude, you're not following copyright law, but whatever, bro. You know, act all high and mighty about it. But then they had like a legitimate like discussion argument about it. And, it, and Bo Blacks was just like, listen, like what you should do then 
if you re- you should react more first of all but when you upload these mm-hmm. like these videos to YouTube that are like oh XQC watches the ice cream man by iDubs like that's just an example I have not watched his reaction yeah. to that but I'm sure he did react to it you know mm-hmm. <laughs> um <clears throat> just like cut it down to the parts where you're reacting so there's a reason mm-hmm. for anybody that watches the YouTube vod to go and actually watch the video because if somebody just watches you watch yeah. it on stream there's no reason for them to go watch the video that's the whole problem that there was with Jinx yeah. there's no reason for them to go and watch the original video unless they want like the full fucking picture you know Yeah. but there was a similar problem with the creator Susie Lou a few months ago she would do it with anime I, again I brought her up last episode I'm not going to get into that whole fucking debacle because it's I, it's, it's more or less the same thing. She's stealing anime content, not doing react. She's not following fair use at all. She's barely reacting, uploading full anime. Fair what? That yeah, what's exist. fair use? We don't have to follow Damn, the laws. Dude. We're above that. We're above I would have that. Loved that. My boyfriend's in, uh, a lawyer. 2015, when I exclusively watched anime re-upload it on YouTube. Yeah, I, I would say go to a certain <laughs> site, but yo, Crunchyroll, let's get a sponsorship going. I reserve. <laughs> um... <laughs> We there are, let's just say, there are places, but you shouldn't go to them. You should get yeah. a Crunchyroll account or a Verve places, Premium. You, yeah. you should go. To, you should, yeah, don't go there. Get a Crunchyroll account or get Verve Premium. Please, <laughs> please sponsor us. Victor here. I don't have 12 viruses on my computer. <laughs> Victor here watches so much anime, dude. He could, dude, he what? could sell the fuck what? out of you guys. He could totally <laughs> get, get you guys banked. So give us. I'll be honest. If uh, with a paid pr- prescription, it makes the whole process of watching anime completely easy. Wait, you say that like you're like you're going to these bad sites. We don't go there. No, 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 no. I use Amazon Prime and Netflix. Exactly. I don't have I an use exclusive Verve. I crunchy use Verve. Um, That's actually true <laughs> as well. I do use Verve. That's not part of the bit. Uh, I do use Amazon and Netflix. Um, yeah, please sponsor us, Crunchyroll Verve. We will We will sell the I, fuck I, out of you guys. I, we. I've I've bought in your merch, Crunchyroll. Come oh, on. Yeah. I, I got you. Yeah. Uh, but uh, they have and some actually ag- pretty again, nice shirts on there. To okay. be honest, on the topic of sponsorships, Raid Shadow Legends, please, we're <laughs> begging you. <laughs> I'm on my hands and knees right now. Yeah, and he's just begging. He's not doing anything inappropriate. Okay, yeah, YouTube I, algorithm. I'm not doing. I'm not doing any prerogative. <laughs> okay, I'm trying to get partnership, dude. It's a fucking saying fucking bad shit. What the fuck, dude? I didn't say anything yeah, bad. Colin, Colin, if you fucking curse one more fucking time, I swear to fucking God, I'm gonna. Bro, I'm you're, you're off the Susan, band. You just cursed. You're out of the band. Colin, you played the xylophone like dog shit, dog. You are <laughs> so bad at playing the piccolo. I swear to God. <laughs> piccolo, <laughs> <I love> piccolo. <laughs> yeah, piccolo's a real one though. If we're talking about the Dragon Ball character, um. Yeah. <laughs> Let's talk about some other bullshit, though. As much as I find YouTube drama entertaining, uh, I don't want mm-hmm. this whole podcast to be about it. Victor, so, since we're you know trying to get that crunchy roller verb sponsorship, talk about some anime bullshit mm-hmm. real quick, all right? Uh, oh, what damn. do you mean by anime bullshit exactly? Uh, <sighs> talk about well, Dragon Maid. <laughs> How, yeah, how's Dragon, Dragon Maid? Maid? Yeah, how's Dragon Maid? Ayo, season two never gonna come out. <laughs> oh, what? I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Dude, we said that about uh, ReZero. It was an in- four years. It was like later, uh, what? Happened. Oh, <laughs> nah, but it had like it had two OVAs before the season. Yeah, came by the way, but, don't uh, spoil you know, anything. Or Colin, mm-hmm. I actually you can spoil oh, things oh, if spoil. we say so, but Colin will just cut it out. Okay. All right. But only about so things that don't matter. So, like, again, <laughs> Dragon Maid. Like, talk about, like, Dragon oh. Maid. Like, not, like, Reese. Shout out my Dragon Maid fans. Yeah, shout out <laughs> to, Yo, Dragon, shout Maid to Dragon Maid fans. Maid fan. Lukoa well, or Ketsukotl it, it, or pretty... whatever the fuck her name is. She's hot as hell, dude. Am I right? Oh. Up top. It's a, pr- it's a pretty Yo, Victor, give me a high five. Victor, truck. give me a high five. Three. Dude, we... Oh. Now they. Uh, no, now I was they just. Uh, there was a bug. There was a bug. Room. There was a now bug. There was a bug. I was trying to get the bug off. We can do it again. No. Uh, dude, all right. We're starting. <laughs> we're starting over the podcast. <laughs> <Restart>. Yeah. <laughs> Forty minutes and we're starting. 
Uh, yeah. yeah, but you know, uh, Dragon Maid's a pretty shit. simple, straightforward uh, slice, slice of life anime mm -hmm. comedy. You know, it's pretty simple. Uh, I, I went into it. Uh, funny. Uh, I do not remember. Does anybody I die? can say that much. It's probably not funny. <laughs> no. Okay. But it 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 did pull uh, the last two episodes. Uh, it got pretty uh, quote unquote serious, where it had a plot. What? Yeah, it's it's. It, it, I I can't explain it without you know episodes? giving spoilers. Yeah, the last two episodes, you just decided. Yeah, check this out. And it was like, Say what it is, what? and then Colin will cut it out. Do I have to? It's yeah. Dragon Maid. Come on, dude. It's been L up for listen, what, I think listen, four years. Listen, already? guys. I'm not being that guy that's spoiling shit for people, okay? Oh, okay. By the way, Snape kills Dumbledore. Yeah. I'm just saying. <laughs> Bro. Cut that part out, Paul. <laughs> 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 that's another that I haven't seen So I'd bottom. say the, the basic gist <laughs> of those last two episodes, it's... Yeah. Colin, you can cut all that out. Yeah. To the viewers at home, this isn't spoiling it. It's pretty much like an adventure time with the Rainicorns, all right? That's all that needs to be known, all right? <laughs> that was that. a very interesting spoiler. Well, yeah. too I, bad I, you guys I, couldn't I, hear I, it. I, 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 yeah. I quite enjoy Dragon Maid By the way, the Darth part. Vader is like Luke's father. <laughs> <laughs> I enjoyed, uh, you know, just seeing, it was just like, just a little, fun, little funny ha ha's, like ha ha. Speaking ha -ha, of ha ha's, that's all Zelda was. is chic. <laughs> if you keep spoiling, the audience will start losing, stop losing interest. Stop losing. That's what you want. We want them to stop losing interest. We yeah. want to retain. Yeah, we don't want them to lose interest. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We want them to stop. Wait a minute. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, start losing interest. They won't. Dang it. Don't worry. I'm sure. You know what the worst part is? Let's say we do blow up, because of course we will when that Raid Shadow Legends sponsorship <laughs> comes in. Um, Not the other yeah. way around. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and people come back to watch the old podcast, because they're just going to be like, oh, I just want to watch more of this. It's so entertaining. <laughs> And chant sounds so sexy and funny. That's so what all their. That's what everyone's gonna be saying. I'm gonna make so many. I'm gonna make so oh. many straight men gay. I did. I, I. I. You know, like. I. You've got me in, under your trance. <laughs> <laughs> um. Yeah, but they're gonna come back because the chants are so funny and sexy and all that. Um. Mm -hmm. Fuck, dude. I, oh, yeah, and, and and they're gonna watch these, and at least one person's gonna be like, wait, Zelda is chic? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I you didn't play know. any Zelda yeah, games, no, and when, when you guys said Zelda was chic, I was like, huh? I feel like everybody should know that, though. like, if you played Smash <laughs> Brothers, they literally turn into each other. Yeah, and Brawl, they spoil it. I, I thought those were just two separate characters, I'm like, whoa, they can switch? <laughs> I knew nothing about Because the, the same thing happened with like, uh, yeah. the Game Grumps Ocarina of Time playthrough. At the end, when Sheik is revealed to be Zelda. Oh, yeah, Dan didn't know Dan that. was like, wait, Sheik is Zelda? <laughs> <laughs> Starts freaking out. <laughs> and then worse than that, in the Majora's Mask one, they're doing some bit about the spoiler owl, which I was kind of stealing some of their spoilers from that episode. And Aaron jokingly <laughs> says, Snape killed Dumbledore. And Danny didn't know that either. <laughs> he was like, I didn't actually know that, Arab. <laughs> like, it's surprising. Oh you think, God. like, everybody knows these spoilers, <laughs> but then they don't. I'd be shocked, uh, dude. How, but, like, how, like, the Darth Vader one, like, how, even if you don't watch Star Wars, how do you not know that one? Yeah, it's iconic. Everybody yeah. knows, I am your father. Like, that is, like, Set Wait, in stone. <laughs> Darth Vader's Luke's I father. Say Darth Vader, that's Whoa. <laughs> that thing doesn't even work. Oh. Bro, cut that no, out. that's cut wrong. That out. Cut that out. Yeah, shout out to my Dang and Rampa fans. Dang and so Poopa. no one. Yeah, like, <laughs> bro, <Poopa>. take it back. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking destroy the eardrums of many people there. <clears throat> I want yeah. to. No, I, I like I like the thing in uh the thing in Rapa art style. Uh, as I found out recently, uh, the artist did make two characters in a uh, FGO, which was a uh, pretty cool. Mm. I didn't know that yeah, until like, and they're Ethan kind of they're pretty hot. Me. Like Kyoko, 
<clears throat> She's got a thick ass. I'm oh, just yeah? saying. Her soup. I, no, I I'd be I'd uh, be a uh, simp if I said Sayaka was hot. Which, by the way, Sayaka's hot as hell. So I'm fine with being a simp, bro. <laughs> I hope you're going to keep this Imagine clean. Imagine being a simp on the podcast and in real life. I don't know what you're talking about. What do you mean simp in real life? I'm six foot five, Chad Megazoid football player. All the women like me. I'm the quarterback <laughs> even. I'm that big of a hot shot. Giga Cracker 9000. What did you just say? <laughs> what? <laughs> wait, what wait, wait. That? I didn't say anything. Wait, hold up. Repeat one more time. <laughs> wait, one more time. What did you say? Giga. Okay. Okay. I thought you said. I thought you said the c word, but I thought the giga part was something else. <laughs> I was about to say, Colin's gonna have a bit of editing to do there. Yeah, oh, guys, yep. no, just no, so you guys I, all I, know, I know my, Victor's oh. super racist. <laughs> we do not condone his actions. Not racist. Though. As not a white racist. person, it deeply hurts me enthusiast. that he says the c word. <laughs> As an Indian, but, that offends my people. <laughs> but, but he is still my friend, and I hope you guys can forgive him too, even though he just hates white people. No, I love my crackers. Oh my god. We're not, we actually, like, if there was ever hope of getting that Raid Shadow Legends sponsorship, it's over. Raid Shadow Legends? No, it's, it's, it's okay. If you sh- Raid, Raid Shadow Raid, Legends was if, made if in you, Israel, so we're okay. If you want, yeah, we didn't say anything anti Semitic. Raid Wait, Shadow Legends, yeah, good, if you want him, if, like, if Victor being gone would get us the sponsorship, we'll get rid of him, okay? Just tell us. In a <laughs> heart band. Do we have, in a heart Do we even have an email for him? Shut podcast? up. Listen, we're not, we weren't... Make the Twitter. I, I've been, gotta make the Twitter I've been thinking chance. about it for like two weeks, all right? I'll do well, it. Well, do it. Stop thinking. All right, guys. Do it. You're going you're gonna to go to the description and follow us on Twitter because it's going to be there in this chance. one. Okay, you it's gonna be to there. Do it right now. And actually take a move. I don't. Make what do you podcast. mean? I told you I'm a wizard. My balls are so mm-hmm. big because I never come. And even though I'm so hot, no, women just don't talk to me. They must be intimidated. <laughs> <laughs> they're Again, though, I would like to state my purpose for wanting to become famous. If there are any hot cosplay girls mm. watching out there, please DM me. Please. <laughs> Pretty please. <laughs> Wait, you have your, your Instagram link, right? Yeah, yeah, it was linked in the first one. DM me they on know Instagram. you're uh, cheating on you, on them, though. Hmm? Because what do you you're mean? cheating on them, though. Mm-hmm. How much cheating on them? Oh, you don't want me to mention her. Never mind. I will, I will. No, I'm going to we'll, tell your we'll, wife. We'll mention her. Um, I, um, you know what? No, I, I'm not even ashamed of it. I publicly simp for... In uh-huh. my opinion, from what I've seen, again, if there's any hotties out there in the viewers, <laughs> you can prove me wrong. What I consider to be <laughs> the hottest and nicest cosplayer, because you can find a lot of dirt on a <laughs> lot of cosplayers, but Paya, <laughs> Paya, I can't find dirt <laughs> about, and she's hot as hell. Victor, you can. F- I, in fact, I want you to think <laughs> she's gross, Victor, because she's my queen, bro. But. Again, oh, yeah. any of those cosplay cute, fire any of the shut the fuck tonight. up. Let me finish my sentence. <laughs> any of those cosplay cuties out in the viewers, <laughs> you can be my punk. you can be my queen <laughs> instead. You can be my queen instead. Okay. I'm looking at you, a mantle exclamation mark. Wink, no, wink. No, we'll put no. a little uh, <laughs> Google <laughs> form in the description. Yeah, to yeah, out yeah th- to see to submit to see if you fit my standards. Yeah. Just kidding. Dude. What would you Listen. rate yourself out of ten? <laughs> <laughs> One. <You> better <laughs> again, Pokimane. <laughs> if you're interested as well, even ten. though supposedly you have a boyfriend, Pokimane, I will completely disavow Leafy and Keemstar. I. Listen, oh, yeah. I, I'll backstab them in an instant. Leafy backstab Keemstar. <laughs> I'll do the same thing, even though they're when not. You talk about the video where he turns around and then there's like a knife, knife in his back. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that, really <laughs> that, yeah. that shit was really funny. Keemstar's a funny guy. Whether you like him or not, he's an internet <laughs> troll. That's what he started out as, and I think he's still doing it. No, he's an internet gnome. I'm funny. No, that was really yep. funny. That was yep. really funny. Yep. I forgot we were back in 2016. Yep. Um, <laughs> so 
just disrupted the entire hey, yo, flow of the conversation. Yo, shout out to my homie Alex. Oh no, 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 no. no, no. <laughs> I'm on blog TV with my fucking hands up. Let me say that. <laughs> We're not starting ourselves, though. We, we are starting. not starting ourselves, but just going to end it there. Yeah. We're not starting ourselves, and we're also ending ourselves there, all right? <laughs> that's, not, that's not the tree I'm dying on. <laughs> I'm dying on that cross. But Alex, oh you know, sleep with one eye open, Alex. <laughs> oh, no. even though, dude, I'm sh- he might not even be alive for all we know. We don't know what Keemstar had <laughs> done to him. What if we could get Alex on the podcast? Yeah, <laughs> yeah I'm Alex. No, not that uh, one. I'm the, not talking the, about the, false the, rape the, accuser, <laughs> uh, I'm Alex, which is... Tongue man. That is his title. No, false tongue rape man. Acu- mm-hmm. No, no, no. False rape accuser, I'm Alex. Everybody needs to know that he's a a, a piece of shit, but mm-hmm. you know. Mm-hmm. But you know, what's how's it going, everybody? I'm Alex. Fuck it. Um, I'm on. I'm on the YouTube. I'm on the YouTube. YouTube. <laughs> Colin, you need to get more saliva in your mouth. Be more of a snake. I'm on the YouTube. YouTube. My fucking fat YouTube. ass tongue is choking me right now. <laughs> How does Bro, he eat? Stop leaking uh, <laughs> personal information no, I, about your body to the viewers. No, no, no. I I already told you. I, my tongue is normal. I, I I'm also six foot five, jacked. You just and told him you had a fat player. ass chin. Huh? You just told him you have a fat ass chin. I didn't say anything about my chin. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. You misheard Wait. me. Am I, am I Wait, going? Are you, are you talking yeah. to me or Colin? Who are you saying said that? I'm talking to you. I never said that. I thought you said that. Colin, Adam's I... apple. No, my name's Alan. <laughs> oh, yeah. I... <laughs> <laughs> okay. You misheard me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Stop my, you guys, fuck, dude. my dad was my dad was handing me some food. I just did like a little heart and thumbs up to say thank you and then he started acting like he was jerking off. <laughs> Bro, is your is your dad gay? <laughs> no. Bro. <laughs> no way. Oh, that's the direction you're going. I didn't even think of that. Listen, dude. That, he's going to be... A, listen. That person is going to be our first guest on the podcast. We can't mm-hmm. We can't be mm-hmm. burning those bridges down just yet, okay? Mm-hmm. Okay, okay. God, Colin, I'm okay. telling you. We gotcha, might have to gotcha. get a different host. I mean, he's just so fucking... I've never heard Wait. somebody play the recorder as bad as Victor. He's out of the band. Yeah. I don't play the tr- recorder. I play the trombone. 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 <laughs> God, that was funny. Yo, yeah. shout out to Chick-fil-A. Yeah, Your food's it. good as hell. You guys want to sponsor Chick-fil-A us? Chick-fil-A does be hitting. I, um, I had Chick-fil-A mm-hmm. last night. Yeah. Yeah, nice. It's really good. Really good. Really good, man. It's closed on Sundays, guys, so you can't go. I don't support what that CEO said about gay marriage, but that doesn't mean their food isn't good, and that doesn't. Yeah. I'd 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 support their message if we got sponsored. <laughs> well, it's just the CEO's message. It's not Become a homophobic for sponsorship. We'd like to clarify: me and Colin do not endorse what Victor just said. Yeah. But it's the CEO. If we, you gotta get on the good at the side of the CEO if Whoa. you want to get on the good side of the company. Yo, Bezos. He does have a pretty good point. I can't argue <laughs> with that one. You want to hit us up, Bezos? <laughs> Dude, we're on the bad side of Jeff Bezos, bro. We we're just shit talking Twitch streamers, bro. And that's through Amazon. Oh right. He. Uh-oh. he we, quote, we're on the bad owns, side of the yeah. richest man. Dang. In the world. We're pretty, pretty, pretty fucked. deep in the hole now. Pretty fucked, yeah. Deep in the hole. YouTube Ew. is shadow banning us. Yeah, that's why our our uh, episode one, you know, it has such a low <laughs> viewer count. Yeah, because it's being shadow banned. Not because we're 
Three I didn't even check the analytics on that one. Did you That's not check the statistics on it? I didn't, no. I'll do it right yeah. now. Live. Um, Live statistic episode. Well, wait, you guys have any... Yeah, I know this is a pretty shitty portion of the podcast. We're just kind of rambling. Um, if you guys have any suggestions, like what you want us to talk about, or anything like that, or what we could do to improve, leave it in the comments. Leave it in the comments yeah. section below. Yeah, yeah. We're yeah. totally down to if improve. If you want more diversity, hey, we can do twenty-one that. views, six subscribers. Not bad. Twenty-one. Hey. Yeah, twenty-one. The 21. funny number. <laughs> well, this one's funny getting to number. sixty-nine, baby. Oh my. It just dropped down to 20. Are you kidding me? Hard what, what, what's down. so funny about 69? Okay, wait. No, it's 21 again. Okay, we're good. Oh, I we thought Susan was taking some numbers away there. Imagine yeah. if that was actually like a real thing. Like it went down. That would actually be like a big deal. Like holy shit. <laughs> like that would actually be like a really big deal. <laughs> I'd assume it was Chance, just a glitch, well, What's so but, funny yeah. about the number 69? It's a well, you see, position. You see Victor, it looks like two men are like, you know, <laughs> facing off the direction. And they have their penises. Which is all good, dude. Face. If you men want to suck the fuck out of each other's dicks, you go for it. Yeah. Uh-huh. We're not homophobic here. We're not. Victor unless Chick fil A wants We're, us to. I'm not. I'm not unless we get sponsored. I've stated. We gotta I've make. Stated yo, I, and you know what? Another one? <clears throat> this one might seem weird. And I don't think they really sponsor people, but yo, Chili's, you want to sponsor us? Welcome I to Chili's. love Chili's. <laughs> Hi, welcome to Chili's. I love Chili's. Like, <laughs> this isn't even like a uh, a joke thing. I, f- oh, I love Chili's. It, and by the way, it is not the same thing as Applebee's. The people that say that, they've never eaten at Chili's. Applebee's sucks. It, it is, it's pretty bad. Chili's yeah. fucking slaps. I like the quesadilla up. burger. I haven't been to Chili's many times. Yeah, I'm just saying because the Chili's I go to, I got a cool waitress that does cosplay. Like, Is games. she a and hot always goss? Re- and always, no, she's not a goss. She's actually a hot blonde. Oh. Um, she always remembers my That's order, dude. Point. What a great place. I love Chili's. <laughs> <laughs> I like how you just listen to something that's like so basic for somebody to do, but that means a lot, man. If uh, if they can remember your order, that means a lot to me. Yeah. If they can remember your face as well. Oh yeah, oh, they, well, they totally remember. Well, you could, you could be like ugly to them, and that's why they remember huh? you because you're so ugly. No, but it's because I'm no, six foot so five hot. and so sexy. <laughs> oh. I'm on the football team, by the way. I'm the quarterback. Yeah. <laughs> See, I just hang How out you with throw these football, two. Then? But even though, again, even though I'm so, so sexy and hot and tall and masculine, mm-hmm. the ladies, they just, I guess they're intimidated. So I hang out with other people that women don't hang out with. Um, they just don't walk up to me. I, I don't know what they, I, I, they must just be scared of my masculine energy. I really, What's up with that? I don't know what else it could be. I really don't. I've, like, thought about it. Like, why else would the women not come up to me? All I do is play Smash Brothers. Hey, hold on. I'm not a pedophile. I'm not a pedophile. Hold on. I don't play Smash. I don't play that game in like seven months. All oh, right. man. Uh-huh. I also, uh, I'm a big competitor in Super Smash Brothers. It's my favorite game of all time. Um, yeah. I go to all the competitions. Oh, what's up? Um, Hang out with all the fans. I've actually won a lot of money from the competition. Victor, um, Victor, Victor, you yeah. might want to call nine one one. Because uh, I think we just found a sexual predator. <laughs> Somebody called Uh-oh. up Chris Hansen, who is not a good person. Shout out Uh-oh. to John Swan. She goes check out his videos on Chris Hansen. Um, I hope Chris Hansen comes to my. Yeah, door. but somebody called up Chris Hansen. Hey there. We just found a, a live pedophile, a real pedophile on the death cam. Yeah. <laughs> well, you you found me? Next. You didn't know I was here? Yeah. You think, we could, get, you think yeah, we could get we chills on the podcast? Yeah, you can do our intro. Uh, you like, yeah. uh, whatever episode number. Oh let's my say it's God. like number nine. Number nine. <laughs> 
Yeah, the dab title. The dab cast. Oh, but actually, <laughs> so I don't know boring. if we talked about this on the last podcast <laughs> or if it was like afterwards or whatever. Mm-hmm. Didn't we talk mm-hmm. about like <laughs> we'd skip number f- the fifteenth podcast until we could get chills on? So it'd yeah, be like yeah, yeah, yeah. Episode yes, like seventy four and then fifteen, just so chills could do the. I guess bit. the viewers will know if they're binging this. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, without the a doubt. Cast binge. Without a doubt, they're binging us. They're rewatching because they love it so much. <laughs> they love yeah. my sexy, it sexy voice and how funny I am. Even though I'm six foot five, I'm still so funny. Right. <clears throat> the talking. Uh huh. He dropped this chance. Yeah. It's your crown. Yeah. Thank you. I'm up here in the clouds, you know. Yeah, I can't yeah. reach you. Uh, I'll have to <laughs> get you a ladder. <laughs> yeah. Hey, how's the weather up there? Yeah, it's pretty nice. <laughs> Maybe that's why women are so intimidated by me. They can't even see my face because I'm so tall. But you're not like you the think? lanky tall. You're like uh, no, I'm you know, Jack. Buff. I'm so buff. Built, I'm so tall. buff yeah. and sexy. Can't you tell? I mean, come on. Like you guys are my friends. Like even though you know what I look like and know how sexy and hot I am, can't you just hear it in my uh-huh. voice how buff I am? <laughs> I don't know, man. I can. I, mean, he- I-, I can hear your neck beat. With the quarantine, you could have let yourself go. You know. Oh. What if you're not? I would never anymore. I- have you not been on the my grind? My body is a temple. I'm on the grind. I'm always <laughs> on the grind. My body is a... Yeah, never skip leg day. Yeah. Imagine skipping leg day. You creep. I could never. I'd rather die. <laughs> I'd rather die than <laughs> skip leg day. <laughs> I should... <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I take working so out gonna, seriously. We're gonna have that Google Forms in the description, right? About the girlfriend yeah. application. Yeah, for I'll, me. you can make it. I'll, I'll leave that to you. You can ask, you know, whatever questions you want. The, the girlfriend app. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> the GF. You know. What if we? What if? What if one actually submits though? Like what? If, uh, I don't uh, know. Check the age first. Lobby one of the yeah. questions. Yeah. I don't really care how old they are, but... Uh, well, whoa. Uh, above 18, whoa, whoa, above whoa. 18, above 18. I, I did not think before saying that. I meant, whoa. I don't care if you're like... <laughs> I, I, I don't, have to call I don't care for if real you're milk time. is what I'm saying. We, we got old Peter Scully over here. Please I don't play <laughs> Smash. I don't play Smash. I promise you I'm not a pedophile. Imagine playing Smash. <laughs> I can't. I don't play that game in, again once. Uh, no. Oh yeah, maybe it's why you're so bad at it. <laughs> what did you say? I said, oh yeah, maybe that's why you're so bad at it. Take it back. Yeah, because he tells it don't. It doesn't have enough. Experience. Yeah, because I, I don't. Maybe if I diddled more kids, I'd be better at the game. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> What'd you just say? I said... Cut this part out. Cut this part out. Cut this part out. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Cut, cut this part, talk about cut this. part out. <laughs> like, theoretically, if some dude molested, like, 80 children. <laughs> yeah, like, theoretically. Yeah, shout out to a dead podcast, am I right? And we're not talking about argument. our podcast. No, because this is the dad podcast, not the we're dad talk- Yeah, we're talking about a dead one. It's buried. In South Dakota, by a certain mountain. Six feet under. Yeah. Fuck that podcast. <laughs> Imagine having a bad podcast. I couldn't. Couldn't be me. <laughs> you know, I've heard of this podcast called the... Yo. Oh, oh stop I advertising. Stop out. advertising. Stop advertising. Yeah. yeah. Cut that part out, Colin. I'm being serious. Yeah. It'll be funnier oh. that way. Yeah, no, I, 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 Cut out my the bad. part of me saying cut that out, by the way. I'm not, no. <laughs> We're leaving that part in. Okay, you can leave that part in. Yeah. <laughs> also leave the part about the child molester. Just in case one of them watches it, I think it'd be really funny. 
Yeah. Just yeah. to prove a point. <laughs> By the way, while we're on the topic of mm-hmm. uh, shit like that, um, I just want to, you know, you know, I'm I'm a younger <clears throat> guy, but I just want to give some advice to our viewers. If you ever, ever, ever tell somebody <laughs> that. Bro, why are you even arguing about that? That shit's stupid, bro. Why are you why are you two even arguing? That's a stupid argument. <laughs> don't watch our podcast. That's fucking stupid. Never. Yeah, don't don't ne- meddle y- someone. Yeah, so if you're not involved in the argument, shut the fuck up. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's some lame shit. Don't be saying somebody else's argument is stupid, bro. Cuz like imagine Yeah. yeah. I ranted about this with Victor for like 2 fucking hours like a few weeks ago. Imagine being like Yeah, imagine- this was originally going to be the inspiration for this episode, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, cuz I was really pissed off. I still am, honestly. Cuz I think it's it, that sh- that sort of thing really bothers me. But uh like imagine like going up to like a Holocaust survivor and be like why were you like even mad about the Holocaust, man? Like it was like no big deal. <laughs> why, why are you even mad? Like, or, like Pearl Wait, Harbor. Where's that dude? comparison? Where's huh? that comparison? No, the it's it, it's just, it's just what? saying like saying somebody like being angry over something. Six million, <laughs> bro. <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> saying saying something is like to somebody else like why are you angry about that? That's so stupid that you're angry about that. Is, okay, that, it, it, that, I don't think that was a very good comparison. No, but, but it's it's to okay. show you, Colin, because that would be absolutely brain dead to say that. Well, it's yeah, an extreme I'm saying I don't example think it's a to prove a comparison point. to that. Okay, here I think this is a better one since Holocaust was okay. obviously a tragedy. Black Lives Matter. Like, why are you even like mad at the police, dog? <laughs> like, that would be stupid okay. as hell. That'd be so dumb. Yeah, that's a better one. Okay. That's so yeah. dumb, and it's an extreme example to prove a point that the basis of that argument in general, it it, it doesn't make sense. Like saying some saying that somebody like being angry about something is stupid makes no sense because that's not fair to say because you don't care just because you don't care about it doesn't mean they don't. It's not stupid to them. Yeah. That's my whole point behind it. I'm just going to leave it okay. there. Anybody who watches our podcast and thinks that way, don't watch our podcast. And that's, that's legit. I actually, yeah. like, unironically, no, this, this thing blows up. You come back to this episode. Our, our podcast supports you, you all, come, lives you come back, all lives. You come matter. back to this and you watch this and you think <laughs> that way. Do not watch us. I, I don't want your a thousandth of a cent. I, I don't want it. Bro. Don't you mean one millionth of a dollar? Shut Chance, you're not up. thinking with your money cap right now. We don't need that a thousandth of a cent if we have yes, Raid Shadow Legends money. Yes, we do. If we have do Raid think, Shadow Legends money, we don't need their money. Do you think in the cobalt slave mines over in Africa, <laughs> do you think slave. Elon Musk... Wait, uh, they go to the nether in <laughs> Africa? <laughs> Shout out to Chinkaroo <laughs> Construct. <laughs> Do you think Elon Musk would accept a thousandth of a cent loss? No. And look how much money he has. You have to use your money thinking cap. At all What's times. Elon Musk's kid going to be named? X- XQC. 12 <laughs> No, XQ Cow. <laughs> His kid Cal. name is... <laughs> oh, what the fuck, dude. Yeah, yeah that's strange. what it is. It's like X Ash twelve. X right? the weird A E combination. A dash twelve. Ash. Yeah, of course. Russian the 12 people is be Roman like. <laughs> I like Kaim. He's got some really <laughs> cool k- names for his kids, but they just don't match with the last name Musk. Like Xavier, <laughs> Damien, and Griffin hey, are. Hey, you oh, smell that? Z- oh, sorry, Xavier, Damien, da- <laughs> fuck. Xavier, Damien, Griffin, and Kai are all awesome ass names. Oh, Griffin! Oh my god! But they do not Griffin match Musk. with Musk. <laughs> Kai Musk. <laughs> Griffin Musk. Yo, shout out to Elon Musk though. You want to come on our podcast? Yeah. Yeah. His net worth seventy point yeah, five billion USD. I think we can beat that again. We upload like, what, what, yeah, we uploaded one video last month, so we're gonna get like six figures, right? Yeah. Yeah. No, we're getting we twelve. We should ask Hassan. We're passing <laughs> that much money, dude. Maybe he can give us some advice how to make that much bank. <laughs> yeah, he can come to the podcast and <sighs> tell us. He's gonna enlighten all of He's us. He's also gonna psycho his big brain. Us. <laughs> you know, Colin, I I don't think you're actually Indian, Colin. 
<laughs> I, I'm not seeing a dot. Oh my god, stop. We're gonna get fucking cancelled. <laughs> We don't think all Indians have dots. Yeah, I know. Oh, all I could have made. I could make a dots. really Only funny fucking women. joke right there, but I, I can't. No, do it. Do it. Yeah. Do this it. is a joke for everybody, and I know that ruins a joke. But I have to say that. Yeah, not all Indians have dots. Some have feathers. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I, I like that one. Okay. <laughs> I'm aware they are Native Americans, and I feel very bad for their plight. I they peer pressured me into saying my own joke that I knew was inappropriate. I've oh made a God. fuck. What did Logan Paul say? I made a lapse in my I judgment. I made a huge lapse in judgment. <laughs> no, but seriously, that is just a joke, guys. I I I, I genuinely think Native Americans <laughs> to this day are still getting fucked over by the government, and I think people. Oh, they sure I are. Think people need to talk about that more. I'm not saying talk about like Black Lives Matter and all that sort of stuff less, but I just think. I, I think severely, like Native Americans have been dealt like a shitty hand since this oh, yeah, was, this country was discovered in air quotes. Um, yeah. And Again, all they're lives still getting, matter. yeah, they're still getting fucked over till this day. Being on the fucking uh, the uh, what 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 are the uh, what are the reservations? Camps? Yeah, the reservation camps or whatever. And they're, you know, the huge alcoholic rates and all that. I think that's all really fucked up. I was just making a joke. Oh, yeah. People used to call them Indians, and there's the whole dots, not feathers thing. That is a joke. Victor is also joking. We are covering our I, ass I here. said I was joking. These are jokes. We do not actually have these ideas in our head because they are fucked. Okay, I don't just want to clarify that, even though I'm sure... I'm not actually Indian. I'm sure anybody Indian. that would actually enjoy <laughs> our podcast would understand that, but... <laughs> Wait, people actually enjoy this? <laughs> yeah, we're not that one podcast that died. Ours is actually... Well, we gotta make more episodes first. Once we make more episodes... Well, after we, we upload start. this one, won't we be fucking tied with them? Yeah, yeah we'll we actually be on par. Oh. Because they okay, made, yeah. like, fucking three others, and they are supposedly all edited, according to my uh, supposedly person on the inside. It's a very trustworthy source. Um, but, yeah, they're supposedly all edited and not uploaded for whatever fucking reason, so. Okay. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Do you guys have anything you uh, want to talk about? All I really wanted to mainly uh, talk about was... Twitch versus YouTube, and again, yeah, just to we, concise we stretched that, over an hour. Pokimane's hot, in my opinion. Hassan's a dickhead. Mm -hmm. XQC's a dickhead. They're not following fair use, and uh, I think this will be really entertaining if it keeps going on. <laughs> I think I, I do want to see how it turns out because Pokimane's already taken the L, as we've seen. Yeah, she she's left now I forgot, on a month I break right now. Up. I think it's uh, really funny how uh, her like mods or whatever on the Discord server made it so that if you, yeah, say, you leafy, say leafy, you get banned. Just, or like even if it's like leafy <laughs> spelt with like a three instead of an e, or I because oh some guy. God. Oh yeah, I remember what it was. Oh my god, dude, this is fucking crazy. I actually forgot about this. I forgot where I heard it from. It was probably scarce. Keemstar apparently. Has had at least one of Pokimane's mods on payroll for the past few months. Wow. And because of that, he has a list of the banned words. What the fuck Ooh. is he's paying people's wow. mods to keep tabs oh on my them? God. That is insane. That, that, that is insane, bro. You know, th that, that's, that's actually super. I smart. love that because I mean, only Keemstar would do that. Only Keemstar would do like that. That's like some. Like billion dollar corporation war shit. Uh huh. And I love that he like, did that. What the fuck? It is so funny to me. Okay. It's so fucking funny. Yo, Chance, I'm gonna start paying you to uh, to keep tabs on that Pia. dead podcast yeah. in case it ever no no Pia. No, Pia no, I, I, no, I no, I no I, amount I, of money. I, I respect my queen. No amount of money. Uh, no, I, everybody has a price. Let's be real here. Everybody has a price. And my price, no. Raid Shadow Legends, I'm looking at you. 
<laughs> or again, Chili's, Crunchy Roll, Verve, Chick Fil A, close on Sunday. Chick Fil A, <laughs> close on Sunday. Chick Fil A, you my Chick Fil A. <laughs> oh, I got some Chick Fil A right next to me, dude. Shit slapping. Well, this was uh, an enjoyable yeah. second episode, guys. Yeah, what I like you this. say? Yeah, I'd say a little bit of a mess towards the end, but I, I'd say we. Uh, oh, definitely. I'd say we are still funny, even if it was a mess. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm quite. I, I mean, that's it's good. I'm always I, funny I, and super sexy, and again, it's the point yeah, to be funny. I was funny. about to say and that, cosplay except for the sexy part. Check out that Google form in the description. <laughs> 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 oh, also again, follow us on Twitter. Follow the official Dabcast Twitter. I'm going to be saying Which some... will be yep. ready. We're right? going to be getting... We're going to be farming a lot of Twitter followers. We're going to be saying some stupid shit on there. 